Hey everybody, it's Glenn, back in this video and following on from my review of Combat Gizmo with Daffy from Nika's Mogwai Series 2. Hands down my favourite Mogwai from Gremlins 2, the new batch. So taking a look at the card back, here's Combat Gizmo who I reviewed yesterday and Mohawk, whose review is forthcoming, so stay tuned to my channel for that. These, of course, are the Mogwai figures from the first series, Gizmo, George, and Lenny. Okay, so let's open Daffy up and take a closer look at him. Oh, look how cute Daffy looks. I just want to hug him and squeeze him. And with Daffy, finally we have one figure where Nika's crazy eye-rolling feature actually makes sense. Operated by a button on the back of his head, you can recreate all of Daffy's manic personality from the movie. And for full Daffy effect, why not throw some food around the room and later perform some amateur experimental dentistry? While you contemplate that, I'll just quickly go over the articulation. He rotates at the head, not quite 360 degrees due to his beard here cutting into the shoulder. He looks up and down. His ears articulate. His arms rotate 360 degrees at the shoulder as they also do at the elbow. His hands also rotate 360 degrees. Unfortunately, no waist articulation, but his legs do rotate 360 degrees and move front and backwards. So you can recreate more of a walking pose for your Mogwai figure. It sucks that the release schedule for these Gremlin figures has been all over the place because when they do come out, Nika knock the ball out of the park with these. I mean, the sculpting is just great. All the fur, textured detail, and on Daffy, I particularly love the way his hair flops to one side. It's kind of almost like an Elvis quiff. I'm so glad Nika finally came through with the Mogwai series 2 figures as at one point it looked touched and go as if they would be cancelled but now that he is here we can finally pair up Daffy Mogwai with his gremlin counterpart and that my friends is very satisfying. Anyway, stay tuned for my review of Mohawk Mogwai. Please comment, rate, share and subscribe. Don't get them wet, don't expose them to bright light and never, ever feed them after midnight.